Hello guys, welcome back to another video. This is part 40 of How to Boost Time His Lovely World in Minecraft. Yep, that is right. We are officially in the 40s and we have done so much. Before we do welcome the secret base, there's a couple light blocks I want to do. So we're going to do the ones on the flag and the ones on the music tower. So on the flag, there'll be one right there. And then there's going to be two on the back. So there's going to be one here and one there. So I'm just checking. We've done these light blocks around here and we've done the light block there so basically we're going to start from up here so where the room is facing the room come to right here and then place a light block there and a light block right there then where this purple one is to the left of it light block and then right in front of this blue torch uh light block there and a light block there come down here two light blocks there move on to this side one two three light blocks N none on these two light block there uh, one in front of the torch one right there and there's be up two there and then one to the right of it come down here light block in front of that torch light block to the right of the underwater torch and one in front of it as well one to the right of the purple torch and one in front of this purple torch. And then one in front of this underwater torch as well. Followed by one in this corner right here. You'll also need one in this corner. And on to this side. One off to the right of the underwater one. And then one to the right of this torch. One right there. So place one there, place another one in front of that, and break that one out, just like that. So it's like diagonal from the torch. Then place one more there, and those are those light blocks done. Then coming up here, we can... First of all, place a light block right there, none along here, and a light block right there. And then place a light block right here, a light block right there. Two light blocks right here. A light block right there, a light block right there. Followed by two light blocks and a gap of two and then another light block. Actually no, it's a gap of three, isn't it? Yeah. And then right down here in front of this one, light block. And also diagonal and down, there'll be a light block there. Then there'll be two in these two corners. Miss this corner, another two. Place one there, miss one, one right there. And then there'll be one in front of this underwater torch. Then coming down here, light block right there. Light block right there and there. And then lastly, come up here. There'll be a light block right here. And then coming around this side, there will be two light blocks. The one there and one there. And those that is the music tower light block placements done. So, in this video we'll be working on the secret base, so we'll continue where we left off in the last video. I'm just warning you now, if you are just coming straight onto this video, we did do this little entrance bit of the main en of the secret base in the last video. So you'll have to go to that video to see how to do that. Just making sure you know that. You know, just in case you already had the underwater terrain so you didn't build it and you just went straight to this, go to the next video. So how should we start this up? So we're going to need a bit of space in here. So I would say break it out from... I'll say from here. So I'm just going to make some space. It's full 49 break that out. Yeah, it would. But we know what goes there anyway. So get out some grey wool and some smooth stone slabs. Grey wool there, slab there, grey wool there. So this is our little area done. So we have two smooth stone slabs from the ladder already. So we're going to have to place more. So I'll count that out now. So we have to place one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have to place eleven more. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Then there'll be grey wool on either side of this. 
so there will be grey wool on this side and there will be grey wool on this side then you can place one more there because that is where the door will be so the door would be facing, I'm just going to do this now, the door will be like that facing that way and then around the door we have to get some light blue concrete blue concrete out so there's gonna be blue concrete there one two three light blue concrete one two three blue concrete one one light blue and then these two will be light blue as well just like that so then if you get out your black wall so black wall will be going all the way down here to there that's where it will be black when it will be all four blocks high that's one two three and four so this will be four high as well this will be four high and this will be four high just like that and then for the roof so we'll just do it down to here so gray wall to there grey water there there is going to be a glowstone so i'll do that now before it gets too dark in here so there's one at the moment so we'll place two more smooth sandstone slabs then a glowstone and the rest of these smooth sandstone slabs so it'll be one two three glowstone and the rest just slabs okay so then we're going to, have to break out some more of these and we're going to need some grey wool and we're going to need some levers. So first of all we'll break out this one. Miss one, break another one. You miss this one, break that one, break that one. So just keep breaking them and miss one until you're two blocks away. And then you just place a grey wall in all of these gaps. With your levers facing upwards. Just like that. So we're gonna have to do some redstone. So where should we go into this room from? Okay, so let's go back here. I did build the whole room we do the redstone, but you don't really see it. So I'm not gonna focus that much on the room. More just the redstone in general. I mean if you want to, you can place a row of grey wool right there. And then on the actual world, there's two torches in here. So that you can place some stone. Like a row of stone along here. And then there will be a torch right there. And a torch right there. And then this is where the wall would be. And the wall's like... this. The wall here is like two blocks high. And then there's another two. And it all goes forward in a bunch. I mean, it only really goes in, but into like your two past the torches. All of this here will be like filled in with stone. And then there's like some stone in here as well. That's only if you want to do this fully accurate. Oh, and also you can place a torch there. So full of redstone. Start off by placing two stone right there. Place three stone there. There's one, two, three, four more, and then two stone right there. So if we get out some redstone torches and some redstone dust, there'll be a redstone torch on this one, and this one, and this one. And there'll be a redstone dust coming out of all of them, like that. And we have to join them all up together. So let's join all of them up. Place two, you can place two stone there if you want. Redstone torch there. Then you can place another stone right there. And then place one, two, three, four going that way. Place redstone on all of that. And then it'll start to go like down a bit more. So. So it'll go down by three. Place a redstone on two of those. 
and then it'll go down again, so... There will be a redstone dust there. Place three more around there, and then place two redstone dust on there. Then place another one going this way. Place it going up. And then it goes forward one more, and then on that there will be a... Redstone repeater. And then, oh, by the way, if you want to do this to the roof, this will just go up like two more. And then this will just be grey concrete, and then the roof here will just be like stone, I guess. This is only if you want, like, even the redstone areas that you can't even get to or see to be, like, fully accurate. I'm just showing you this. I actually didn't build the full room on my reference. I'm only showing you up to, like, here. So, I'm only going to show you up, up to there, probably. So, let's just get back to the actual main build we're doing. So, there'll be stone right there, and then we'll put that across to... And it'll go up one more and it'll be like four long. So one, two, three, four. So all of this gets filled in. Just like that. And then we can have redstone dust right there. Place redstone repeaters and fl flick them all back by one. And then place another two redstone dust there with a torch right there. Also there'll be a torch on that one. And then I just build two, and then two, and then two, until you get to there. And then all of these are just going to be redstone repeaters, all of them being flicked back one. I think that's the redstone done, I believe. Obviously, you can continue building back this wall, fill in the floor of stone, do whatever you want with this area. I'm just going to leave it like this, because, yet again, this is not the priority at all in this video. So, if I believe that is the redstone done now, so what you could do is come back in here. So, flick that one down, flick this one down, and that one down. The door should open. So, I'm just going to keep the door shut. So I'm going to flick them all up and keep the door shut. And then, I'm just going to go into the main, main area room. So, this is where the actual big main area will be. Well, where we have this door, we might as well start it like this. So if we get out a stone pressure plate, you can play a spoon stone stab there and a pressure plate there, you know, so you can like get in and out the room. So let's get out some, so let's get out a couple blocks. So we're going to need, for now, let's just get out some light blue concrete, blue concrete, and some cyan concrete. So from here, oh no, we're going to clear out some more arrow, don't we? So we have to clear out some stuff quickly, so. Okay, so I just cleared out all of this area right there. So now we can place three. So, so we'll have the door here. Then we'll have a blue, uh, blue concrete there. And then place three cyan concrete. Followed by three blue concrete. Followed by another three light blue concrete and another three blue concrete. And then three cyan concrete. Three blue concrete. Three blue, three cyan. And then three light blue. And then in this corner here, there'll actually be a diagonal. So it's going to be. So make a, a diagonal from that, there'll be two smooth quartz. Uh, slabs. Then we place three blue diagonal to that. So like a little corner there. Place two cyan concrete. We're gonna need to get out some pillar quartz. So there'll be a pillar quartz right there. So then we'll need to get out some black terracotta. And place five, one, two, three, four, five, and then go diagonal again with your smooth stone slab, and then go with nine black terracotta after that. So 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then come out one here, and there'll be a smooth stone slab. And then we can go back again with some black terracotta, and we'll place one, two, three, four, five. So there'll be 30 black terracotta along here. So this is one. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and that will be 30. We're going to have to break out a lot here. So all of this here will have to be broken out. Because then diagonal from that, there will be a pillar quartz right there. So we have the pillar quartz there, and then we can place... So go back and place four, one, two, three, four black terracotta, followed by a pillar quartz right there. Break down this a bit more. Then place three blue concrete, two cyan concrete, place a pillar quartz right there, and then place three light blue concrete there. No, do not do that. So diagonal with the pillar quartz and diagonal again with a cyan concrete. Then three light blue concrete. Then three blue concrete. Then three cyan concrete. Three. And then three blue concrete. Oh no, it doesn't add up. We've done something wrong. I think it's on this wall right here. So there's one, two, three, four. Oh, okay, I see. So it's supposed to be five. So the pillar quartz goes there. So that's five black terracotta. So then the blue goes there. The sign would go there. The pillar quartz would go there. So then all of this should go back a layer. And yeah, now that will add up to the wall. So if we come to the next layer, we'll start by placing a blue concrete like that. Then we'll place three cyan concrete. Three blue concrete. Three light blue, three blue, three cyan. One blue is actually going to be a smooth stone pillar right here going up. Then we can place a blue right there, light blue there, three blue, three cyan, two light blue, two slabs like that, and then a light blue, three blue, cyan, and then yeah, pillow quartz. And this time, instead of black terracotta, we're going to need... It's going to be five grey terracotta. So get out our grey terracotta and place five. One, two, three, four, five. Then extend this up again. Place grey terracotta along here until you get to there. And then along this entire wall will be grey terracotta as well. Until you get to there. And then extend that up. And then place one, two, three, four. Four, five grey terracotta. Followed by a pillow quartz. And then one light blue. Three blue. One cyan. One pillow quartz. Two cyan. Three light blue. Three blue, three cyan, and then it'll be two light blue, and it'll connect up to that. So that's the second layer around the secret room done. So next row, we'll place two more blue concrete after that, followed by three cyan concrete, three light blue concrete, three blue concrete, another three cyan concrete, two smooth stone slabs. 
there will be a light blue concrete here. And right here is actually going to be like a TV. Which we can start to fill in. So it's actually one, two, three. So I think it's seven black concrete. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then a light blue. It is seven. I just don't know if this is black terracotta or black concrete. I think it's black concrete. Yeah, it is. So then bring up those two smooth stone slabs again. Two light blue concrete. Two blue concrete. Pillar quartz there. Then a gold block there. Pillar quartz right there. And now this time we're going to need... What can we get rid of? We can get rid of our black terracotta. So we'll now need red terracotta. And there'll be red terracotta on top of this. Extend the slabs up again. So then all of... So here there'll be red terracotta. And then you get those two stone slabs. All of this until you get to the very end. Will all be red terracotta. Pillar quartz right there. This will be red terracotta, and that's going to be, there's going to be the gold in there, so, gold right there. And then light blue, free blue concrete, pillar quartz, free cyan, free light blue, free blue, free cyan, and then one light blue. So... I want to start to focus on one wall at a time now. So where we have the red terracotta, extend all of this red terracotta up by just one. We're going to have to break out a lot of area in here again. So I'm just extending this all up by one. And then you can extend up the pillar quartz there by one. You can extend up... The smooth stone slab by one, and you can extend up that by one as well. So, what we can do from here, place one, two, three more blocks of slab. So, one, two, three. And then, yet again, over here, one, two, three more pillar quartz, just like that. And then, we can place three more rows of red terracotta. So, one, two, three. Coming down here as well, one, two two and three and all the way down here so one two and then three this will be three going up as well like that so we're gonna so on this wall there is both some so it's red concrete and also red concrete powder so we're gonna start from over here also the last two over here can be red terracotta as well because this thing will start same over here these two red terracotta and then there can be two pillar quartz there as well. Two pillar quartz there. So on top of this pillar quartz right here, there'll be red concrete powder, then two red concrete powder down there, and then red concrete powder right there. I don't know what goes here, so you can just place one more red concrete powder. Okay, so it's, st it's starting to get a bit difficult to see what I'm placing. So I'm going to go get some night vision out. So, so we're on this wall, there'll be one, two, two, three, four, five red concrete broken out. And then go down, place one, two, three, four. And then up here, there'll be one, two, three. There'll be paintings in this one, two, three, four, miss those four. And then there'll be one, two, right there. So one, two, three, four, just like that. They'll be painting there. Miss two. Two red concrete powder. Miss four, one, two, three, four. And then on the fifth one, go up. And there'll be... 
Red Concrete Palace is a 1, 2, 3, 4, just like that. Extend that over by 2. Go down by 3. And go up and go 1, 2, 3, 4. And place the last 3 in with Red Concrete Powder. And then right here, place these 2 Red Concrete Powder, these 2 Red Concrete Powder, and this one Red Concrete Powder, just like that. So then, last thing we'll do, build up these Pillar Quartz by 2, and above that, place 2 more. Same over here, we've got to break out a bit more of this little big area. We can technically break out all of this in here. So. So then place two pillar quartz like that. And then two up here. And then in here. I think this is on both sides. Yes it is. We need to get some gold block and an emerald, block of emerald. So there'll be a block of emerald there in the middle and a block of gold on top. Same over here, emerald in the middle, gold on top. And then on this side, you can just place two cyan concrete on top of that. On the other side, there'll be two light blue concrete on top of that. And you, what you can do is also, you can build up these smooth stone slabs to that layer right there. Same with these ones, just build them up. I know it is one block until you get to there, but there is actually going to be something else in those. Or is it the whole way up? Probably, yeah. Yeah, actually, just build them all the whole way up. So build this one the whole way up. What about the pillar quartz? I mean, you don't see them anyway, so you can build up the pillar quartz the whole way up as well. So that will go the whole way up. This one will go the whole way up. This one you would, would see, so does that one go the whole way up? Yeah. So that goes the whole way up. Keep digging all of this out. This hill go the whole way up. And yeah, I think that's just like that. So in the next video, we'll be either continuing or finishing the what's it the the secret base. I know it looks kind of messy right now. Like if you want to, you can place. Two light blue there, two blue there, one blue there, three light blue right there, cyan there, three light blue, two light blue, two cyan. Just like make it a bit cleaner on this side. Same thing over here. Make it a bit cleaner, you can just do three light blue, then there'll be a cyan, two cyan, three cyan. Uh, blue there. Three light blue, light blue, light blue, just fill all that in with light blue, just like that. So just make it a bit cleaner, we're working on the rest of this in the next video. For now, I hope you enjoyed the video, I'll see you all next time, bye guys.